This weekend sees the conclusion of German football's third division. That is, of course, the Dritte Liga. And I'll look at the league table. We'll show you that most things are already sorted out. FC Magdeburger champions. It's great to see them back in the Zweite Bundesliga. Joining them are Eintracht Braunschweig, who finished second. They've had an incredible season. And in third place is Kaiserslaut. And they are going to play Dynamo Dresden in the playoffs to see who goes up or down. And all that's left to play for is at the very bottom. SC Val are taking on MSV Duisburg over on the other side of Germany. And here at the Friedrich Ludwig Jan Sport Park, Victoria Berlin are fighting for their lives and they need a win against SV Meppen. But let's get inside the stadium. Here come the away fans ahead of today's game. Long way to come. And that shows dedication. It's a quality turnout from SV Meppen. Just before we head inside, of course, I do have to show you the outside of this stadium. Those floodlights are unbelievable. Beautiful floodlights. And a very, very impressive setting for the last day of the season in the Dritte Liga. But let's get inside. Top class facilities here, of course. Just got inside the stadium for today's game. There's the away fans. What a turnout. Players are out on the warm up. The home end is starting to fill up as well. Massive game, massive game. So about 10 minutes away from kickoff here, I'm just around the back of the stadium and the atmosphere is building up nicely inside. Yeah, about 10 minutes or so away from a massive day for Victoria Berlin. Massive day, they have to win and hope that SC Val lose at home to MSV Duisburg because of the goal difference is better for SC Val. So. Yeah, Victoria Berlin, they have to do their part. If you don't know anything about the club, they were founded in 1889 and they won two German titles before World War I. And yeah, it's a great club. This was their first season in the Dritte Liga and they are hoping that today is not a bad day for them. And a word for the opponents, SV Meppen, well, they were founded in 1912. They got a long-standing history of German football as well. And their best time really came in the 80s and 90s when they were in the Zweite Bundesliga. But yeah, another great little club from uh, the other side of Germany. And yeah, they don't really have anything to play for, to be honest. They can't go up and they're not going to go down. So uh, yeah, it could be a dangerous opponent today for Victoria Berlin. But yeah, let's get inside. We're about to find out. <laughs> So 15 minutes here, it's still nil-nil. Victoria Berlin are playing well though, to be fair. And it's still nil-nil in the SC Val game as well. So uh, yeah, nothing's changed at the moment. About 15 minutes played. And the Meppen fans are unbelievable. They are determined to enjoy their final day of the season. There's been a development in the other game. MSV Duisburg are winning 1 0. So if Victoria Berlin can get a goal, they could be staying up. And yeah, it's still about five minutes to go in the first half here, and it's still 0 0. Right, 
Right, where are we? It's half time here at the Friedrich Ludwig Jan Sport Park. There's about 50 Scottish lads have turned up in kilts. That's good to see. And uh, yeah, it's nil nil here at the moment. As I said earlier, it is one nil to MS Far Duisburg in the other game. So Victoria Berlin just need a goal and they could, well, pull off the great escape today. But uh, yeah, they've been creating chances, but no cutting edge at the moment. But yeah, still 45 massive minutes to go here. Let's see what happens. So the teams are back out now. Second half about to get underway, I'm going to get back to my place. Massive 45 minutes coming up. Goal for the away side. That's a hammer blow for Victoria Berlin. Just two minutes into the second half, and that is a hammer blow for Victoria Berlin, who now need two goals to stay in this division. And the attack just now, actually. That's good defending, but yeah, two goals needed and about 40 minutes to do it. Oh, the referee's given a penalty to the visitors. Things are about to get worse for Victoria Valley. That noise you can hear behind me is of course the away fans, it's now 2-0. It's not looking good for Victoria Berlin. Now need three goals and hope. Yeah, it's not looking good at all, I think they've gone. Now 2-1 here, Victoria Berlin are back in the game. These are uh, fucking brilliant by the way, these fans. Uh, yeah, 20 minutes or so to go. And we need two more goals and hopefully MS5 Giesberg do them a favour. There's a third goal for S5 Meppen. And that has probably killed it off now. These fans don't seem to be too upset by that. Probably the end of the game now. It's now 3 1 to S. Meppen, and in the other game it is still 1 1, so yeah, looking grim for Victoria Berlin here at the Friedrich Ludwig Young Sport Park. Go Victoria Berlin have a goal back. <laughs> Two 
two minutes ago, it is now 3 2 Victoria Berlin need two more goals and hope that Duisburg give them a favour in the other game. But uh, yeah, it's not looking promising to be honest. The atmosphere is incredible though. Chance! It's in! 3 3! The other game is still 1-1 one, one as far as I know. Oh no! Esfal Mepin have just scored. It's now 4-3. All oh, those dreams have gone. <laughs> 15 seconds after Victoria Berlin scored. Just silence now. Yeah, it's now far three, and there's four minutes of injury time to go here. Can't believe what I've seen. Can't believe it. Chantage at the post. So Victoria Berlin stay in the Dritte Liga, last just one season. They, unfortunately, are relegated today. They put up a valiant effort, to be fair, and they did score three goals. But, uh, yeah, conceding goals again, that has been the story of the second half of their season. The first half of the season, they were quality. They're actually top of the league for a while, but, uh, 
yeah, the second half of the season has really killed them and they are back in the Regional League and not us for next season. It's a shame for the club, shame for the fans, but they will live to fight another day. Fair play to S. Van Meppen, who played the game and their fans were incredible coming over here when there was not really a lot riding on the game for them. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it from me from the Friedrich Ludwig Jan Sport Park. I'll see you on the next video. Subscribe below if you're new. Cheers.